Hey folks, welcome again. Now it's time to build something with our Cosmic Dream GPT, which is which has been made by Chad GPT. It's a visionary painter of digital wonder. Okay, so we are going to build something along the lines of folks. As you all know, I'm a big fan of the three element thing, which basically means having three things on the same plane. So for this time, it would be build something with car cat and coffee in your terms and ways so folks three random things that have no relation to one another car cat and coffee in your terms and ways and within a few seconds it's going to create a wonderful cosmic image for us and i promise you folks you will be amazed and baffled by it not only by its brilliance but also by the fact that the image has appeared on your screens here is it folks what is it it is car coffee and what was the what was the other one car coffee and cat so it's a cat inside a car wow this is fabulous folks look at that the cup is in the form of a car okay the body of the car this is very good actually i didn't see that in the first part and the cat is sitting inside a pool of coffee which is brilliant it is brilliant literally a brilliant ai creation folks think about it if ai can do these things now when it's literally taking baby steps if it becomes a teenager it's it's going to be a real real wonder folks i'm telling you it's going to be a real wonder mark my words moving on to the next image because we can only generate image with this one let's assume can we build something like um, something like something along the lines of what should I make with Cosmic Dream? We should make invent a new emoji. Invent a new emoji and make the image. So I've asked it to invent a new emoji and make an image out of it. Let's see how it performs. Look at that, folks. It it actually, this is so wise of GPT. It actually gen put it in a cosmic way, obviously. It put a laughing emoji with the glasses on, with the glares on, and it made it in a pattern that it, if, it, if you look at it from a distance from where I'm looking, it looks like the sun. You know, you have this happy images of sun smiling and all that anime thing, portrait thing. This is exactly looks like that. And this is beautiful. This is genuinely, genuinely, genuinely beautiful. I'm going to download these things, folks. Folks, every time you see a good picture on Dolly, download that. You have the full permission to do whatever you want to do with that. Next one. Let's uh, build something really good with that. Let's, uh, let's, let's take it to the next level, folks. Actually, I have another tool called Leonardo AI, which probably you will see in this course series. Maybe you will see that, maybe not. And I'm going to go there. I'm going to get a prompt from that. I'll not generate image there. I'm going to go there. I'm going to get a prompt for that. And once I get the prompt for that, by the way, I'm using two different browsers. One is the Microsoft Edge and the other one is Brave Browser. for So that you don't have confusions in your head. You can use any of that or one of that or anything. It's completely your thing. This is folks Leonardo AI. This is literally like a version that is not as good as Dolly, but pretty good and you can you will see why i'm saying that and i'm going to take a prompt from leonardo i'm going to put it in cosmic dream and see how it works okay 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 which one should i do let's let's take a real difficult one which would which would really make a, a lot of sense okay ah this one's good yeah this one good folk because there are so many elements there are trees moon a girl a forest pathway light then a ghost or something this would be good okay so i'm gonna oops made a mistake there ah no problem we can copy the prompt here and i'm gonna close this window and i'm gonna put this prompt here and i am going to let it create a prompt so folks this is so cool using AI to prompt an AI to create an AI image for us human beings. Isn't that easy? Yes, it is. You're going to create this image 
and within a few seconds we are going to get an image that would probably be that good or maybe better than that let's see if it generates something completely different oh boy here we go so it has generated the image and it's taking a little time to load it up in the shadowy embrace of light, ghostly yokai whispers their tales, weaving a tapestry of mystic something. Oh, I don't think I. I don't know. Maybe it didn't download that thing. Something happened and it didn't download that. Okay, no issues. We'll do that again. Maybe I'll download that and let's see if it works or not. Here is it folks, here is it. Actually it didn't load in the first one and then it did, so I'm sorry for the delay. Here is it folks. It's not that cool, but it is quite cool folks, quite cool. I'll, 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 I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll download this thing and that is how easy it gets into my computer. And it's, it's good, it's good. It's not as good as that one, but it's good. Maybe even better than that, it's completely your choice. But actually, um, in the meanwhile, I just wrote there, it didn't load and <laughs> Cosmic Dream started creating another image of that. Maybe that'll pop up in a minute or two. So folks, that was it from this lecture. And you can see how you can create stunning images, literally in just a few prompts. Just a few prompts and images come up just like that. Probably I think folks, Cosmic Dream is, in my opinion, is a cosmic image version of Dolly and... Uh, yeah, that is probably it. And maybe we'll try to play with it by asking it what were the prompts that OpenAI put in to make you. <laughs> that is so, that is so, such a bad habit of mine. But okay, no problem. That was it from this lecture, folks. I'll see you in the next one with some different GPT. See you there.